So, this recording, which is Friday, the 13th of September, 24, or 2024, I want to say 2014, um, Power Rangers is effectively dead. I'm pretty sure they're still doing the comic books, but in terms of the uh, TV show, yeah, it's done. Uh, basically, if you have not heard, uh, Netflix was working on a reboot, and um, they canceled it, leaving basically anyone who wanted to see any new type of uh, Power Rangers on TV or on the big screen or anything, they're now, that's now gone. And it led me to an interesting question. What if Toei actually started doing it? Because, I mean, technically, being that they're the ones that basically gave Saban the footage and let him basically use it for years, um, they basically have, they can do it, they just basically need to buy the license, which they probably could do. But I keep thinking, imagine Power Rangers if it was done by people who know who to do tokusatsu and have been doing it for over 50 years, I think. I'm not exactly sure when they started as a company. I know that basically next year is going to be the 50th anniversary of Go Ranger. Um, so basically they've been doing it for a long time. And basically they've been doing Super Sentai for 50 years, pretty much. So... To say that they know something about Tokusatsu would probably be an understatement, being that they've also wait they've also been they've been doing Common Rider, um, not yearly but basically ever since seventy one. So yeah, they've been doing it for more than fifty years. But I keep thinking, what if they did? Because all they really have to do is like they need like an English script, and they need to hire like English speaking actors. But everything else they could do in house, like the prop making, CGI, um, other things. <laughs> that I could, I thought I could come up with another example, but I couldn't. Uh, just more proof that basically all this is unscripted. But I mean, technically, they could do it. Because, I mean, if no one here wants to touch it, they might as well do it. But, like I said, first they're going to need, like, the license, because they got to probably buy it back from Saban. Um, how they could even bring him in, but basically just, like, have him be a consultant. Because, I said this before, I was not a fan of how he basically kept on trying to make it into a rehash of Mighty Morphin. Because Mighty Morphin's been done. It's been done 30 years ago. You don't see Toei basically rehashing, like, Go Ranger every year. No. They come up with something new, new cast, new everything, and they, uh, they do callback uh, things to, like, earlier seasons. But that's usually just, like, a cameo for special. Like, how they had Go on Red on Boom Boom Jer recently, and apparently they're getting uh, Tokyo Ichigo back. Uh, Ichi or, uh, Tokyo Jir actually is a show that they actually didn't turn into Power Rangers, because mainly it's about trains, and they think that uh, kids over here, and it's probably too, aren't really that into trains as they are in Japan. But also it might have something to do with the fact that the Rangers can sh uh, change colors, and they had like... Um, Red become pink. That might be a little controversial. It shouldn't be, but it might be controversial in their eyes. I'm not exactly sure, but they did actually do have like a uh, a gay couple in like the last one I've heard. Because um, apparently the Green Ranger had a girlfriend, and the girlfriend apparently became a ra ranger too. So, so. I mean, as I said, it is possible. And if Power Rangers was to continue, I'd actually prefer that. Because, 
there's a lot of things made these days that are basically just focusing on the money. And honestly, it's destroying it. There's also too much nostalgia these days. And personally, I think nostalgia kills creativity. So, that's basically the video. Uh, did not go as long as I thought, but oh well. Short and sweet. So, until next time, guys, this is Shocker Cyclone signing off. Let me know what you think in the comments. Uh, please share this video because it really would help my channel. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And you'll actually be seeing more of this content. Hopefully. I would really like to give my um, thoughts on Gav. Uh, but I want to wait for a few episodes to, to get like a better picture of it. Because I've only seen two. There's only been two episodes released. And as good as it looks, it's still new. I mean, I knew I was going to like Geats from like the second I saw that, but like, again, it could have fallen flat out of space. Thankfully, it didn't, and basically, Geats is now like the high bar in my book. But like I said, it's still new. So, until next time, guys. Second attempt pro sign off. I know I really, really should start maybe doing scripts for these. It might probably help delivery. We will see. Anyway, bye guys. See you next time.